Okay, this is a uh, 1979 SWM 320LT trolls bike um, that I'm just about to start to restore. Now, the the, uh, the 79 model, which was this, actually didn't come out in yellow and black, but it actually came out in the. This is this should be the the red white uh, version. The yellow version like this came out in 1980. So at some stage, someone down the track decided that the red and white wasn't for them anymore. And they went with a bit more of a later look with the yellow. Um, so what I'll be doing, I'll be stripping down this bike and completely repainting it the way it should be with a red frame. And uh, the, the petrol tank should be should have should be red and this face here should be white with a black pinstripe going through it there and obviously the SWM's riding as it is there um, yeah so other than that the bike is completely original other than the colors um, obviously the mud guards have been changed as well um, so I'll be putting white mud guards as they should be per factory um, one thing that I have done is I've already painted this uh, number plate there just to see how things would look and I like the, the red and white. What you have down here is this bike here is obviously an American import as you can see California Highway registration number there and that red there is the red of the uh, the frame, the original red from the frame. So, um, yeah, someone's just uh, someone's just decided that they, they didn't like the red. Um, yeah, and uh, another thing I did is I repainted the the side stand, but I had to lengthen it by 75 mil because it was just too short and the bike was just leaning too far over, just about to fall over. So I just put an extension of 75 mil and straightened it up a bit more. Other than that, um, everything's original here. You can just see little bits of red coming through. So the forks, forks have to be red. Triple clamps and all that should be red. Um, yeah, so this is a very nice bike to ride. A very nice seat here, original seat. And um, yeah. One thing I had to do, or well, there's a couple of things I have to do, but one thing I had to do is remake that bash plate because as you can see, the original bash plate's absolutely smashed and ab absolutely worn out to, a, to, to the point where parts of the subframe here have been scraped on whatever, they've been jumping over logs and, and rocks and stuff. So I've made a bigger, stronger bash plate there and um, the foot pegs. The foot pegs are going to be the well. The foot pegs are going to have to be changed. I'll be putting bigger foot pegs on those ones as well, just like I did on my um, Ital Jet here, which you can now see the finished video of uh, this Ital Jet that I restored. So you can see part one and part two of that Ital Jet. So here you go. Um, this will be part one of this uh, SWM restoration. So um, this will take me a couple of months to finish. And uh, I'll, I'll repost uh, part two of the restoration of this SWM. So just check, so subscribe to my channel, the Matter Guzzler channel, and I'll, uh, and I'll post uh, more videos coming up. Please put a comment, a like, and I'll see you with more videos to come. Thank you.